Hello everybody, it is Brooke and Donye here with Two for the Soul. We're going to do a fun little get to know me segment with yes. Donye. I'm going to ask her some really tough, gut-riching questions. This could get this could get interesting. 20 questions. <laughs> so we're going to get started. Are you ready? Yes. Are you nervous? Yes. Are you excited? Kind of. I mean, at least we don't have... I'm really curious as to what you came up with. <laughs> at least it's not like a lie detector tip. Like test or quiz or whatever you know I just hope I answer appropriately <laughs> Guess we'll find out. <laughs> are you ready for question number one yes okay number one what is your signature dance move anybody that knows me I'm not a good dancer by any means <laughs> so do you want me to stand Same. up and show you um you can just do like a little thing and then you can show us in a no little I bit. do this you like move your knees the, the, the old dance where you just go okay. like this that's just my signature move that's all I do. <laughs> I feel like that helps. That, that tells them. I, well, I'm kind of with you. I don't dance well. No. So, I'm the same. It skipped my, that, I skipped that gene somehow. <laughs> I don't know. I love that. Okay, number two. If you could have unlimited storage on one thing, what would it be? Food related? Anything. Unlimited storage oh. on one thing. Clothes, probably. Yeah. Yeah. Closet? Yes. Yeah. Yes. I'm kind of with you on that. I'm like, I always like overflow. Yes. And then I'm I have to. I'm always like, I have to, okay, I'm out of hangers. I should probably start getting rid of stuff. But if you're like me, just go buy more hangers. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right. Number three. Um, would you rather whisper your whole life or shout your whole life? Oh. You can only whisper or shout. Which would it be? Whisper. Mm-hmm. Shouting can get really kind of crazy. Yeah. I feel like. I feel like I'm really good at shouting. <laughs> I, I, mine would probably be shout. <laughs> You're laughing because you, you, you know that's true. <laughs> you do that already. It's okay. okay. Uh, number four. What is one weird thing about you? Oh. That's a good question. I like so that many. question. That's There's a good so many. Question. I talk in accents all the time. Okay. So if you're not used to me, like, I just talk in different accents and... Just you want to share on one? <laughs> just one. I like to do Maria a lot. <laughs> but I love that. I do love that. She does do that a lot, actually. <laughs> that's my that's my Maria voice, and then I have I have a lot. It's get, it can get kind of crazy. My mm. sister actually asked if my husband knew before we got married if he knew how weird I was with my accents, and I was like, Yeah, he's aware. <laughs> one more, one more, one more accent. Um. Can you do one on the spot? Oh, I'm trying to think. Uh, one that I used to do. I used to do Felipe, which is a guy that I used to work with. Oh. And he go, oh, bebe, what are you doing? <laughs> Don't talk to me like that. I know come back to work. <laughs> <laughs> so Felipe and Maria are kind of the same. They're, they're all the same. Just one's a man, one's a woman. But once you <laughs> meet Felipe, you know that I talk just like him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, you do. I hear Felipe a lot and Maria a lot. <laughs> they both come out. All right, um, if you could only eat one thing for the rest of your life, what would it be? That's such a hard question. Just one thing or one, one thing. type of food? No, one thing. Oh. One thing, baby. No. <gasps> That's so hard. Salsa. Ooh. I'm obviously Mexican. With a guys. spoon. <laughs> Salsa with a spoon? Yes. Because you know chips, that's one whole other thing. Oh, no. Oh. Salsa, yeah. I could live off salsa. I don't know what I'd eat it with. Salsa is amazing. You can put it on anything. You can put it on you eggs. Can. You can put it on chips. You can put it on it has vegetables. vegetables in it. You can put it on vegetables. It has vegetables. You use it as a dressing. Okay. So that's a good one. I like that answer. What's your favorite TV show? Any good trashy reality show. <laughs> I'm a reality, like the reality, I'm, yeah, like, I'm a reality, like the Housewives yes. shows. I watch all the Housewives. I watch like anything on Bravo. Not really so much E, but everything on Bravo. Blow Deck is like my newest favorite. That is right so. Now. You know, I can't say I'm surprised, but I never knew that about you. That I love reality, TV. trashy, trashy TV. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's a guilty pleasure. Yes. Um, if you could have dinner with anyone in the world, who would it be? Sky's the limit. Jennifer Lopez. Oh, J Lo. I love her. I think I that's a great her. choice. I've, I've loved her since I was really, really young. Ever mm -hmm. since she did Selena. 
That's like when my obsession came. I that's like one of my favorite movies. Why are all my I thought she was Spanish Hispanic. (laughs) You are Hispanic. I know. (laughs) I just didn't really realize. I seriously thought that Jennifer Lopez was Selena for like the longest time. I love that movie. That's a great movie. movie. It's a good one. Um and the bustiers. Yeah. Anyways. That's another accent that I do, <laughs> but we won't go there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I feel like we've kind of already answered this. What's your favorite food? Mexican. Mexican. Yeah, <laughs> I knew that one. My okay. mom also owns a Mexican restaurant, so like I, I mean, Every anytime meal. I was hungry, it was like, okay, you've got to eat Mexican food, so. Well, it's you in your DNA. It. Well, it literally is. Literally. <laughs> literally. Okay, then what's your least favorite food? I'm a food junkie. I kind of like I know, everything. I know. Um, maybe Chinese food. Mm-hmm. I love Vietnamese food. I love Japanese food. Yeah. Chinese food. Chinese is too I, heavy. Chinese, I have to be like in the mood for. Yeah. It's and like, heavy. I'm not always in the mood for it. Yeah. Really, I'm almost never in the mood for it, honestly. <laughs> Unless it's like midnight and I'm like watching movies or something. Yeah. I don't know why. I'm in the mood for Chinese no. food. No. I just love rice. Um, what's the first thing you thought about this morning? Um, I hope, <laughs> I hope I didn't sound sick. It was the first thing I thought. <laughs> I, I was like congested whenever I woke up. I was like, I better start taking the medicine. That Oklahoma wind. Yes. Those hours. Yes. That season. Just full. <laughs> Three things you can't live without and go. My dogs. Uh-huh. My husband. <laughs> <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> Priorities. <laughs> Priorities. Um, do my husband and my kids kind of go hand in hand? Uh, we can okay. this one time. Okay, yeah, that's kind of. <laughs> um, <laughs> the dogs first. I feel so bad. It's okay. What else? What else? Could I not live without? Probably my phone. <laughs> if I really had to be honest. I feel like that's a really hard question. It's like a hard hey, thing. Hey, my makeup. Okay. I don't know. So you'd rather have makeup over your phone? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. I mean... I don't wake up like this. I mean, if you <laughs> if you can't live without your husband or your kids, then you basically communication is tied in with that. Yeah. I'm just trying to find reason, but it's hard. What is your favorite Disney character? I love that. Cinderella. Classic. Mm-hmm. That is definitely a classic. What's your favorite movie? Ooh, that one's tough. I know. I hate being asked that question. You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> there's that. Uh, oh my gosh, I don't know. During Halloween, it's Hocus Pocus. Ooh, but okay, we can I do love that. different seasons. I love um, mm-hmm. La Bamba is like one of my favorite movies. <laughs> Probably haven't even watched it, have you? I don't even know if I've heard of it. What? It's about. It's a. It's a true story about Richie Valens. He died in a plane crash with Buddy Holly. Well, then I might have to look it up. It's a good one. La Bamba? Yeah. That's it's a great like name. <laughs> I love that name. <laughs> I was about to say, I wasn't going to say anything. But this was like Dirty Dancing and Pretty Woman. Those, was two are like, an- those are classics. Yes. Those are classics. Um, uh, what's your favorite flower? A lily. I love lilies. I have it tattooed on my back. Oh. Oh, you do. Mm-hmm. That's right. There's a lot of favorites on here. Um, what's your favorite memory? All-time favorite memory. You have to choose. All-time favorite memory? I didn't come up with that question. Um, you can thank Kat for that one. <laughs> there's a lot of bad memories from when I was younger. <laughs> we don't like those. <laughs> um, probably... I would say whenever my brother was born. Okay. So he was like the seal the deal of like the family. Were you, or is it just you two? Just us two, well I have an older sister. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Just us two, oh yeah. <laughs> That's simple. <laughs> <laughs> so <I'm a> <laughs> That's funny. And I was six, so I remember. Like whenever yeah. we and everything. I wish, you know, I'm the baby. I wish that we would have had one more after me, because that would have been fun. Yeah. But, but then you kind of get like the I like being mommy nice. duties. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah, I don't think I like that. Um, winter or summer? Oh. I like that question. 
Summer. Summer. Yes. You sure? Final yes. answer. Summer. But I love the clothes in winter. I know. I like the layering of the clothes. I feel like I like the way I feel in the summer. Yeah. Because I feel like there's only two seasons in Oklahoma. <clears throat> yeah. You get really fall cold for like a week. Or before. really hot. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. You get, there's really no fall and there's really no spring. No. That doesn't really exist. No. Um, do you have any hobbies? And if so, what are they? No, not really. I mean, I work out a lot. Is that considered That's a hobby? hobby. Yeah. That's a good hobby. And I like to That's organize things. Hobby. I actually go to my friends' houses and like organize things for fun. I should start coaching. <laughs> you should. You should. I was going to say, you, uh, she's a planner. She's an organizer. Yeah. She's uh, pretty good at like design and stuff. I mean, you wrapped all those presents under the tree. <laughs> I, they were really cute too. They were like perfect. They're like Hallmark movie perfect. Yeah, my brother was like, how did you learn how to do this? I was like, I mean, <laughs> you practice? You I don't practice. know. I mean, you compete with your it's sister on who has the prettier presents and you just learn <laughs> to get creative. <laughs> I love that. Um, are you an early bird or a night owl? You know the answer to that. I'm an early bird. I wake up at 5.30 and all my friends like think I'm crazy. So terrible. But I'm asleep, but like don't text me past nine because I'm asleep. See, my alarm goes off and then I snooze it for at least an hour. <laughs> I hit snooze. Really I hard. set it at a, at a time where I'm like, I can, I need an hour. Yeah. It's like I know that I'm going to have 50 more minutes after that first alarm. Yeah. So it's like, ah, uh, okay. <sighs> yeah. Hmm crazy. Number 19, what's your Starbucks order? A Trenta iced green tea with just three pumps of sweetener. Yep. A Trenta, that's huge. Isn't that like 32 <laughs> ounces? The, yes. No, it's a 30 ounce. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's like I added two ounces. <laughs> okay, uh, so wait, what? A 30, uh, Trenta what? Iced green tea iced green with just tea. three pumps of the sweetener. Because I don't like it super sweet. They normally do seven. So I only put in three. Holy cow. And it has like Did zero calories. Seven? And it's a great anti antioxidant. I feel like I'd be wired. It. I would be <clears throat> wired. That's a lot. If, if, I, if I ordered it just normal, yeah. seven pumps of sweetener. Oh, yeah. That's insane. It's so sweet if you get it like that. But I don't like wow. real sweet stuff. Um, number 20, last but not least. And I already know the answer to this, but for everybody else. Do you have any animals? If so, <laughs> what kind and what are their names? I have two dogs that I'm obsessed with. Bruno obsessed. is, they're both rescues. Mm -hmm. So that's like my, so we don't really know what they are. He's kind of like a lab chow mix. Uh -huh. And then I have Hazel, who is not even one yet. She's still a puppy, but she's like a border collie puppy. boxer pit mix, yeah. I think. But she's a great lake dog. I love rescues. I just think you can't get a better dog other than a rescue. Yes. I really don't think you and can. We have bought a dog, <clears throat> my husband and I, and it didn't work out. Just And then yeah. after rescuing one, and they're just like, their hearts are just a little bit different. Yeah. They're just like so appreciative. I love rescue. Yeah. I know. Mm. I, I love if dogs. If I could save all the dogs, I would. If I could have my own like rescue, <clears throat> we can just part let's like just partner dream. up. Okay, yeah. that'll be our new hobby. Okay. That would be my hobby. That would be my if hobby. My husband would allow it. I would just save all the dogs, but he's like two is way more than what we need. <laughs> Me like but. five or six or <laughs> twenty. It's fine. Um, okay, well that was fun, ladies. Um, if you enjoyed that little segment, getting to know Donye, love it. A lot of great things going on. So make sure that you follow our YouTube channel, like and subscribe, and we'll have more fun creative content coming your way. Thanks for watching. Bye.